Hi, this is John and Amy with TPF Trips, Places and Fun. We are here in Colorado where we are visiting Santa's Workshop at the North Pole here at the base of Pikes Peak. And it is a super fun themed Christmas land, a little theme park. So we're here today and we thought you'd like to check it out with us. If you are visiting the Colorado Springs area, this is just a short drive and it's super fun. It's kind of like a little amusement park, not super huge, but not expensive either and a great way to spend the day. For an all access wristband, which gets you access to every single ride on park, it's $25 a person. If you want just a limited number of rides, there's a few select rides you can ride for $15 a person. And if you don't want to ride anything at all, but you just want to walk around, shop, eat, and have fun, that is free. So there's seven of us here today. We bought the all access passes for the three kids. We had a military gift discount because my parents are here, and that was $66. Hey, and I think we should mention that they need to check the schedule because it's not always free. And sometimes reservations are required, like near the holidays. Oh, okay. I saw that so, online. Yeah, so we didn't need that today, but it, when you're here, you might. And then we have a map. So that is where we're going. So a lot of these are just kind of your old school, almost like fair rides, huh? Yeah, so it's more kind of like a carnival or fair rides. They do have a train up there. I can see it going now that looks really fun. Stuff like that. But a lot of them are going to be the more carnival rides. But it's really fun because yeah. it's themed like the North Pole. And who doesn't love Santa Claus and the North Pole and elves and, and all that fun stuff. And we can hear Christmas music in the bathroom. In the background. In the bathroom. <laughs> you can, Probably in the bathroom wow, too. Wow, Christmas music everywhere. <laughs> and look at this. There's Santa's show house. 1130. What time is it? take a bite out of the map? I don't know what happened. Maybe that was a hungry elf or something. I don't know. On behalf of Thurston, myself, and all of us at Santa's Workshop, that will do, mate. Thank you so much for coming. Have a wonderful oh. day and a happy Christmas. Goodbye. <laughs> happy Christmas, everyone. Happy Christmas. Well, it's raining a little bit. It looks like the rides are still going, so. So is it uh, your turn next? Oh, the kids love this ride, but to spin two different ways, like going that around like that and then around like that, I just cannot handle it, but they love it. Well, Amy, we did confirm via the uh, magic of the internet yeah. that uh, the holiday season, which starts November 1st, is priced differently. Right, so during the summer, if you're not riding rides, you can come and walk around for free. Starting November 1st through Christmas Eve is the final day of the season. It's $25 per person, whether you're riding rides or not. Right, and then you also discovered a summer pass. A summer pass for $45. So if you come twice, you can you know, pay for the cost of one day wristband. So 
Yeah, what a deal if you are a local. I hear screams. So how'd it go? I'm really dizzy. Feeling a little, feeling a little wobbly. <laughs> Oh my. Remember this from like what? How long ago? We were here 15 years ago when I was pregnant with him. And our Whoa. older two were little. But it's been a long time. So food options right here at Santa's well, workshop. Right, we each got, um, or they each got a scoop of ice cream. And a scoop, when we say a scoop, it fills up the whole bowl. Three fifty each. What, so. uh, what other choices do they have on park? Um, well, my mom got nachos and funnel cake. And so they have all that kind of stuff. They have hot dogs, hamburgers, you know, that sort of stuff. Chicken tenders, sandwiches. And glass. So it's beautiful here. I mean, obviously, right up here in uh, the Rocky Mountains here in Colorado, uh, Colorado Springs area, it's super nice. And you know, while uh, you know the rides are going to be your typical kind of carnival rides with a Christmas twist, um, it's pretty. And just uh, the, the trees, and we're up in the mountains. And uh, right now, everybody's in the souvenir shop getting some souvenirs, shirts, and things. And so it's a beautiful day. It stopped raining, it's sunny, so nice. Love it here. Got the souvenirs, all our Pikes Peak, North Pole. So show me, gear. show me one example. Okay, so, so Eva got something, Ella got something. Jet's wearing what a, he got right here already. This is what Eva got. Okay, let's check this out. I love it. What? So there was a discrepancy in there. Do you notice the two different uh, shirts with different elevations, the top of Pikes Peak? Yeah, off by five feet or something. Yeah, your dad did some research. Oh, great. And it was uh, recalculated using, you know, modern GPS. I don't know how many years ago, not too many years ago. And so, um, there, yeah. So five it, feet higher or five feet smaller? I think five feet higher. Okay. So that's good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. Oh, it's snowing. It's actually bubbles. Oh, <laughs> it's cold. It's, it's snowing. snowing. You know we just finished 2020 when that's what they think of. <laughs> it's snowing at the end of June. <laughs> that's what the kids all think of after 2020. It's hand sanitizer. It's, hand, it's forced hand sanitizer. <laughs> you will sanitize. <laughs> all, all right, guys. Hey, did you buy that? Very nice. 
Hey, look at this, Amy. There's even a post office. Oh, this is a real po this is a real post office. So if you want your um, letter postmarked from the North Pole, you can postmark it. Oh, hey, that's I cool. believe that's how that works. I like me. that. We have this little uh, this little area out here has some fun stores. They we got have a Christmas a shop. Christmas shop, toy shop, candy shop. So lots of great stuff like that. And there's this Elmer the Elf show, which we're really intrigued about. Yeah. But it's not it's not happening right now. Did you see this? Yep, we have a video on Kohl's. Hey, we, we? we have a video on Kohl's. We went to their popcorn and candy store. Really awesome people. And they're selling their popcorn here at the North Pole. Hey, Kohl's. It was so good seeing you. And hey, Ella, I bet the Kohl's are going to watch this video. You should tell them you saw them at church the other day. Oh, yeah, the other day I saw you at church. <laughs> but, <laughs> but clearly not loud they, enough, they right? She didn't say hi loud enough, but she, she's repping with their... She's repping! Look at that. Oh, no. Good job. Go to Coles in Colorado Springs on North Academy. Hey, hey, Elmer the Elf is here. Uh, so Elmer is animatronic. That is not what I expected, but it's fun. part of the park that has some more thrilling rides so uh, Jet's feeling pretty good about uh, this area. Most of the park is for the younger kids but uh, or or medium-sized kids but this one moves a little quicker so I think uh, he's a little happier about this. Oh, it's gonna start snowing in a minute. Yeah? <laughs> Bringing the magic, Santa. Come on. How you doing? Doing well, doing well. We saw the snow come earlier and all the kids were saying, it's hand sanitizer. <laughs> you know we just finished 2020 when that's what they think of when the bubbles well, actually, come. actually it's magic snow made by my elves, Johnson & Johnson. You know, the ones that don't oh, cry. That's yes. right, very yeah. good. Okay, that's much better than hand sanitizer. <laughs> what? Hey, there it okay, is. You there predicted it, is. it, Santa. <laughs> Look at that. You know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh. oh, my goodness. That's so cute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they found Santa. Look at mommy. And that's so what Christmas cute. is all about, Amy. <laughs> so cute. Or, oh. or June. <laughs> or June. Or the middle of June. <laughs> June at the North Pole. Oh, uh, we got picture taking time. And look at this. This is a never melts. It's an ice block. Yeah, it's ice. Oh, it's freezing. So here's an interesting comparison, Amy. We went to Worlds of Fun um, at the beginning of our trip, and now here we are at this much smaller local park, but it seems like Jet's having a lot more fun here. I think the reason is the wait times are so short, so they can get on in you know a three to five minute wait, and so he's having fun just going from one thing to the other. Of course, at Worlds of Fun, you're looking 30 to an hour, 30 minutes to an hour. Or more. Most, or more on most rides. So this is nice because the kids, they can just go boom, 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 like, and spend the whole day just riding rides. This is a park that it would take, what, maybe two, three, four hours total yeah, to get everything done? Yeah, we've been three hours so far, and they probably have maybe another half an hour worth of stuff, and they're not doing the stuff that require adults because we didn't get the adult tickets. So they're not doing the Ferris wheel or the Sky Ride or the zip line. So if we were going on those things with them, it would probably be another hour. So. Yeah, and this Ferris wheel is the top, it's the highest Ferris wheel in the world. Yes, because we're at a very high elevation right now. So, but yeah, there's, and there's quite a few rides they haven't done yet. So you could spend all day here. They're open 10 to five currently. When the holiday season starts, they're open 9.30 to 4.30.
enjoyed our day at Santa's Workshop North Pole. And wow, what a great place for the kids. They just had a ball. We didn't even go on everything. We were here three and a half hours and we have something else for tonight, so we have to leave. But boy, you could spend five, six, seven hours here. And it's so iconic, so fun to see all the Christmas stuff year round. And of course, great fun, you know, cute rides. We loved it. Hope you get to check it out sometime. Safe travels, everyone.